Houston experienced record-breaking low temperatures just one day into this multi-day cold snap. The temperature in Austin Camp Mabry reached 16 degrees, which breaks the previous record of 19 degrees that was set in 1944. Austin Travis County remains under a hard freeze warning through Wednesday. Because of that, six overnight cold weather shelters will stay open until then. To sign up, go to the One Texas Center at 505 Barton Springs Road between 5 and 8 p.m. You can also call 311 or 512-974-2000 if you are unable to go there during that time slot. So far, officials say 400 people and seven dogs stayed overnight in one of the shelters. We encourage people to consider getting to a shelter early. Please don't wait. The temperatures and wind chills are low enough to make hypothermia and frostbite a real threat. General Manager for Austin Energy Bob Kahn says the utility has set a new winter peak. Our previous peak was 2,630 megawatts, and right now we're hovering at about 2,760. Khan says everything on Austin Energy's end looks good, but the utility remains in constant contact with ERCOT in case that changes. ERCOT says the tightest times for power availability will be in the morning hours of Tuesday and Wednesday. It'll be up to ERCOT to decide if Austin Energy will have to conduct controlled blackouts. But if that's the case, and that's not anticipated at the moment, city officials have a plan. We've identified non-critical load areas and what we will do is to make this where nobody has more burden than someone else in our city. What we will try to do is we will try to roll those outages in such a way that you will not have any one area have more than 40 minutes. As for the roads, Austin Transportation and Public Work crews have pre-treated and retreated 36 high-priority bridges with 500 gallons of brine solution. Public Works crews worked overnight to ensure our roads are safe for our emergency services and other critical services to be able to move around our city safely. Our field staff are working 12-hour shifts, rotating shifts. There are also three warming centers available. Those are going to be open only during business hours from 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. Those are going to be listed on our website, fox7austin.com, if you need them. For now, reporting in downtown Austin, Amanda Ruiz, Fox 7 Austin News.